You have a chance now with the students leaving and so forth to kind of assess what's happened at this point. What's happened at this point? There's so much that happens between when you get in here to this point. Where are you guys now compared to where Oh, it's happened so fast. I mean, you don't have a time to breathe, really. Uh, the kids will be back on Monday or student athletes will be back Monday. And uh, heck, you just uh, you go from with this caravan stuff now. We go around the state and get to shake hands with the, with the orange and blue. I know this, that there's a, a bunch of Illini faithful that we're excited about seeing each and every week. Technically, this has been the off season for you, but not much of an off season with spring practice and all the things that you had to do. How much are you looking forward to actually getting to the fall and getting here to the actual season part of it? Well, I mean, that's what it's all about is playing games. But, uh, you know, you're you're establishing a program, you're building the program, you're changing the culture, uh, you're, you're, you're putting your fit into the program. And, uh, you know, that's all part of it when you come in and uh, get involved in a, in a program like Illinois. The most difficult part for you coming in and starting fresh at a brand new place like this? Uh, you know what, difficulty is, uh, you know, this being the second time that I've had to come in to a, to a program, it, uh, you know, I don't, I don't know if there's anything that, that I can put a finger on and say uh, that this has been difficult one way or the other. Uh, I established a staff that I believe is very capable of, uh, of taking the program to where we want to take it to. So uh, we're excited about what's going. Well, I talked to Coach Gonzalez last week or a couple weeks ago, who, and he talked about the familiarity that all that coaching staff has with each other. But even though you guys all are familiar with each other, how long before everything starts to gel and you all start to feel real comfortable with what it is that each of you has to do within the program. Well, I wish we had that magic number. There's no question about it, but uh, I know one thing. I've been around this profession for 47 years, being a coach's son, and one thing that was always told to me every place that I had been at was surround yourself with good people and people that believe in the same things you do. And uh, I've been very blessed. It's not just nine football coaches, but it's nine families that have joined our football staff and are very, very excited about the future of Illini football. Actual football question for you coach you come in you guys have a chance to assess what you've got now uh, battles start to present themselves one of the key ones with Nate Shieldhouse and Riley Oto when do you guys make the decisions on who is you know where those battles are when you start moving forward with with that part of things the greatest thing about football is you make those decisions probably Thursday the day before the first game <laughs> Uh, you know, that's why you practice. That's why you're, you're involved in, in going to Rantoul and spending a, uh, a, like an NFL camp um, and then going through two a days and those sorts of things. That's, that's the greatest thing about football because you're going to have 13, 14 opportunities uh, to play the game if you're doing things right. And uh, with those 13 and 14 opportunities, it's how you play each and every week that matters. And uh, we've been very lucky because we've got a situation at quarterback where we have really three to four capable quarterbacks.